what's going on? Hope you're having a shit one. Today we're gonna go for a little drive and check out the conditions that we're in right now. It's really foggy. Roads are very empty at the moment. Today we'll be driving my car for the first ever time doing this. This is my 2018 WRX STI Premium. I've got on it the NVIDIA R400 turbo back exhaust. Let me pop the hood and I'll show you. It's also got this brand new Process West cold air intake. I've tuned it all together with a Cobb access port and that was tuned by Got It Rex in Melbourne. And yeah, honestly, it's been so much fun to drive. It sounds awesome. So what I'll do, I'll hook another GoPro up on the exhaust so you can hear that a bit better. But we're basically just gonna go for a little drive up to the hills and then we're gonna take some photos. But before we start, we're gonna take some photos here because I'm just gonna park the car on the road there and get a couple of shots because this looks too good to pass up right now. I've got the Sigma 105 mil and I'm shooting on my camera, which is the Sony A7R Mark IV. I do have a polarizer coming for this bad boy. This is like the size of my palm, like that's how big the lens is. But the polarizers for these things are only made by Sigma and they're also $400 a pop. So mine's on a back order at the moment, so I don't get mine for four weeks. So unfortunately, I don't have a polarizer for today's shoot. But I think it's going to be, I think it's safe to say that it's going to be an overcast day today. That's going to help me a little bit, but yeah, I might still get some reflections in the windows, which is going to annoy me, but hey, at least we're taking some kind of cool shot. So forgive me for that. Let's just move the car into position. I'm just going to leave the car right here. <laughs> Fuck them. I'm gonna have to be really far back for this shot. Bloody 105 mil. Oh, there's a little puddle here as well. You can get sort of a bit of a reflection here. A bit of a mood going. I hate the touch operation. It's just so shit. Oh. Oh, fuck. Sorry. <laughs> Thank you, sorry. <laughs> Have a good one. <laughs> I don't know if he was pissed off or whatever, but Bloody fuck him <laughs> My bad. Oh well, the shot's so fucking cool. Who gives a fuck? I'm gonna park my car in the middle of the road just to be more of a dick Thankfully, thankfully there's not much traffic. He just seemed like a good old farmer bloke Let me back this up I love how many cameras this car has. It's so easy to get it perfectly in the middle. Well, it's pretty good. Oofed. Oofed. Oh, that looks fucking good. Oh, I did a really good job getting that in the middle. Please, no cars come. Okay, good, there's no cars yet. I got a couple more. Gotta go really far back. I have it on high plus as well. I always shoot on high plus. It takes more photos and it uses up more storage, but I'm gonna switch this to F2. But it means um, I'm less likely to have a shaky shot. We took some really cool photos. If everything else for today fucks up, that's okay, because we took good photos. So anyway, ooh, let me just park my car off to the side here and I'll stick a GoPro on the exhaust.
it that well, but this is the other photo spot. We've got some color in the leaves here, which is kind of cool. But <laughs> usually like in the summer, well, not even like right now in autumn, on a clearer day, you can see like the whole way down, but that's not the case today. It's actually pretty horrible for photography. I'm trying to think maybe it'd be still be cool if I were to park the car somewhere on the side here. say in Australia. Let's see what it looks like when it's parked here. A little bit of wheel turn. A bit more. Oh, that actually looks fucking sick. <laughs> well, I ran out of photos on this SD card. This photo's fucking sick, but the car needs to come on the road a bit more. <laughs> but we're getting there. I'm gonna bring it out a little bit more. Well, now's my chance. Still, thank fuck I came quite early. All right, let's try and do this quick, because I'm literally on the road. Ah, fuck, I can hear a car. My bad. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> He's gonna yell at me. I'm oh, just taking a photo. I'll be two seconds. Jesus Christ. Well, smiling and waving just did not work that time. <laughs> People just don't get car photography. It's like, bro, you don't understand. The car was too close to the tree. Like, what do you want me to do? I have to park it on the road. <laughs> Oof, this looks like a pretty good shot. Wow, they're really loud birds. Oh, some beautiful colors going on right now. It's so nice. Can you move your car off the road? Oh, people amuse me. It's fair enough though. My car was on the road when it shouldn't have been, and it was, so. And then she yelled at me, so. Kinda gonna give her a free pass on that one, but it's still funny. I just wish people, more people understood photography. I was like, you don't, you don't get it. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Fuck you! Fuck you! Yeah, that's what I thought. I'm the king of the jungle. Man, can... Oh, shut up! Compared to the 105mm, this lens is like... So fucking wide. Like, way too wide. <laughs> the 105mm was just a beast. Oh, I actually like that, how it's dirty.
You go, you're going to yell at me as well? Or maybe she's taking a photo. Well, I'm just standing in mud right now. Uh, do it for the shot. Ah, oh, loving these colours. Ooh, that's a pretty sexy shot. Actually, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, work it, baby. Oh, oh thank God I have a polarizer. It looks so much better. I'll show you the difference. I'll take a photo now with polarizer and then without. Exactly the same settings. And then check out the glass and the shots. Looks really different, hey? That's why you need a polarizer for car photography. Ooh. This is a very sexy shot. Mm -hmm. Oh, that looks fucking sick. Can I shoot through the beam of light? Oh, I can. All right, let's move it up a bit. Go see if anyone yells at us a bit higher up. Let's have a look at this shot here. How's it going, mate? Better just wait for that car to come through, but and I think it looks really cool with these trees here. Good day for photos, huh? Nice and clear. <laughs> Gonna shoot this on F2. Yeah, I don't know if I... I really like that shot. Maybe this shot I might like better. Maybe this angle is better. I don't know, but you see how like I'm just walking around the car and just trying, like walking around before I really take the shot I'm happy with. You know, I might try like, a bunch of different locations until I'm really happy with the shot. I think like where we were before was the best. But that's how, like, you're going to take better photos by trying different angles. Really, photography is, like, mainly about the angles. Cameras have, like, enough technology in them now to, like, take back a lot of dynamic range. So your settings don't even really matter that much. Only really your aperture, like, your depth of field. But most of photography is, like, your composition and your angle. That's what you want to be looking out for. I think, like, that's too much of the side. So I'm going to come back here and shoot a bit more of the back. See a bit of a difference between these two shots. So like how that's too much side and I feel like I need more back of the car. So I come around a bit and shoot more back than side. And I think that's a bit more prettier to look at. However, this kind of gets in the way here. So maybe I'll just like keep it off to the left of the image if I shoot it like this. And I stand up a bit maybe. One a bit lower as well. Maybe one at the back here with the badge and the wing. That's kind of a cool shot. Yeah, I think my favorite, uh, I think my favorite shot is like this one. I think that's gonna come up really nicely. Or one of these ones. You know, because there's a lot of colour. Like, I love these ones because there's colour in the ground and in the sky. No, this is fucking sick. Well, I think that's uh, I think that's been a pretty successful photo shoot. I only got yelled at by, like, 
two and a half people, which is good. Um, there was some guy when I was driving before, he like, I don't know, stuck the finger up at me or something. Maybe because I was driving a bit fast, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, just like always, if you did like this video, leave a like down below or help me out by hitting subscribe. And with that all said and done, have a shit one.